Hi Pete, this is Katie. Um, so let's say I've got the um, Vocaroo link. Actually, I need to make this a little bit. There we go. So you can see I'm on Vocaroo.com. I just I've already recorded something. Let's say you wanted to um, paste it into Blackboard. So after you've done the recording and you're happy with it, you listen to it and it's there. Then you click on the link. It says click here to save. And it gives you several options here. The one that we found that works is just by clicking on this and saying copy. Right, so this is the link that you can take and copy into um, Blackboard. So let me go over to Blackboard then. And depends on where you want to put it here, but like you can say, let's say create item. And here's audio link here, whatever. And then um, let's say click here to access my audio. So whatever it is that you want to be a link, you highlight and then you click on insert edit link. Okay. Then you paste into the link path, the link that you copied from Vocaroo. And then for target, I always choose this to be blank. And then I hit insert. So then and that's where it gives you that um, link. Or you can just do a paste. Oops, control V. And you could just make this link be live. So then highlight that. And again, that process is clicking your little link icon, pasting the link path into that field, and then selecting open in new window and insert. Either way, it doesn't have, notice that the text that is the link doesn't have to be the URL itself. Okay, then you submit. And then we should see something new all the way at the bottom of this. So then here's my link. So then if I click on this guy, it starts playing my voice message. Okay. So that's how to add your Vocaroo link to your class. Now that's as an item, but that same editor, that same, those same tools that I was showing you with the link, you should see in several different areas of the course. Okay, let me know if you need more on that.